I used to think about immature things. And a peek into the locker room. Players soaking in the last few moments before the game. Some final preparations here. Thanks for joining us midweek here. Tonight, we bring you the NBA on 2K Sports. Along with Grant Hill and Richard Jefferson, this is Brian Anderson, and we've got our reporter, Ali LaForce. Ali, take it away. Well, Nikola Jokic has transformed his conditioning. He said, when I first started playing back in Serbia, I couldn't do a push-up. And when I came here, I was probably the worst conditioned player in the league. I lost a lot of weight, and I feel much better. To be honest, I don't run faster, but I can play a lot longer. That's what matters. Brian? Yeah, it helps, for sure. Thanks, Alec. And for an idea of how the league is shaping up right now, take a look at these latest power rankings. They have to be frustrated right now, falling down into the bottom of the rankings. When I look at Denver, they're on a roll, showing a lot of confidence in themselves. The fans are energized, too. We'll see if they can keep it up. And the Lakers starting five. LeBron is the four with Davis at the five as they go small. D'Angelo Russell is out there with Malik Beasley. And it's Achimura in at the small forward position. And for the Nuggets, Murray and Caldwell Pope are the backcourt pairing. Porter Jr. and Gordon at the three and the four. And it's Jokic in at the five. Well, when we talk home court advantage, you think the Nuggets have the best in the NBA? I think so, B.A., and it has to do with geography. Denver is at altitude, and that's hard on your body, trust me, I know. And they're isolated from the rest of the league, so it always is a long trip out there as well. Murray against Russell. Murray, no good. Now here's Davis. James passes to Russell. Misses the three. Jokic against Hachimura. Pass to Murray. Now Porter from downtown. Nails it from beyond the arc. And once Gordon spots an open guy, he immediately moves the ball. Just well-coached offense right there. Outside Russell. Davis with it. Pass to James. Clock at six. Davis with a screen on Gordon. The three, James. That shot, no good. Now Denver takes it the other way. Outside Murray. Here's Caldwell Pope. On the wing, Porter. Jokic's the screen. Murray passes to Porter. Tries again. Davis with a rebound. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Pass to James. Just over a minute and a half played here in this one. And Davis with the basket on the assist from James. Defender plays tough, but Davis is tougher. Plays through the contact line, just with ease, just with authority. Jokic with a screen on Russell. Outside Murray. To the wing, right side. Here's Jokic. And it's blocked by Davis. And this is how AD led the league in block shots. It's not just his wingspan, but it's his awareness, his basketball IQ when it comes to reading the game. Now here's Hachimura. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. Easy possessions like that literally are just a gift. You just dream of them. He'll gladly take those. Here's Caldwell Pope. 15 in his last outing. Here's Jokic. And it comes off the front of the rim. And he felt like he needed a little bit more space with the fade to get off a shot, but that might have been what threw him off and made a miss. Back to James. And slam dunk by James. Oh my God, LeBron James with that, that, that power. Do you just feel the rim shake? Pass to Jokic. Right wing. Jokic with a screen on Russell. 
James with a steal. Oh, there's the alley. Davis misses. Looking for the spectacular and coming up empty. Just go to show how tight your timing needs to be on this kind of play. To the left side wing. Here's Caldwell Pope. He's guarded by Beasley. Unloads from 13. No good. A bit long that time. No clue how he misfired on that shot. You don't see that from him very often. The shot by Russell. No good. The Nuggets trail. And in 2022, more history made by Nikola Jokic, becoming the first player to amass 2,000 points, 1,000 rebounds, and 500 assists in a single season. Now here's Murray. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. That shot is off. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. The Lakers have gone just three for seven here at the start. Beasley misses. And Nikola Jokic breaking barriers at the center position, Greg. Oh, so true, B.A. That 2000-1500 season, it never been done before. The Joker's ability to be a facilitator at the five, almost a point center, We've never really seen that before. Now, here is James. His last outing, we saw him score 22. To the paint. Outside for Russell. Here's the three. And the three-pointer goes. And what's working here? Each guy is willing to make the next pass. Denver has gone one of four from deep. Timeout time called. Time the Nuggets. Coming off a win against the Blazers. And, and you know, some games, you're plagued by false starts and slow momentum. You could tell they were getting frustrated. But what a gutsy win. To struggle in the offensive end that much and still win the game, that says something about the character of a team. The Nuggets making a switch here. Bryant's checked in. All right, let's go to the leaderboard and see the top passing teams last season. In third, the Nuggets. They were patient, and they were also unselfish. And it helps to have guys who are willing to make the next pass. Caldwell Pope outside Murray. Bryant a screen on Russell to halt the run. Murray finds Bryant. Just four to shoot. There's the triple. And again, Denver no good. He is just so deadly from out there. You expect that to fall. Now James down low. Tries from six feet. Davis misses. Denver has gone one for five from three-point range. A cold start. Out to the wing. Outside Murray. Gordon on the wing. Over James. And again, Denver no good. For Los Angeles, they've gone 4 of 10 shooting the rock in this first quarter. And we've heard LeBron James say he's obsessed with win or bust. And this Lakers franchise certainly has that same approach. But aside from their 2020 title, there's been a lot of frustration. 
now. Can he and the Lakers get back where they expect to be? Now a timeout called by Denver. Well, we're still in the stage of the season where new teammates might not be in sync, RJ. How long do you think it takes for a team to gel? Well, it depends on the amount of turnover. If you're talking about adding one or two different guys, that's something versus adding five or six. After training camp and preseason, teammates have a better chance to kind of figure things out, and they should be on the same page by now. Denver. Green's checked in for Gordon. Brown comes in for Porter Jr. And it's Smith in for Jamal Murray. And Denver has possession. They trail by nine. Bryant outside. Pass to Smith. Five on the clock. Tries to snap the cold streak. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. That went on Schroeder. And guys, over the last several years, Denver's been top ten in offensive rating. Now, they played a slower pace, but made the most of their possessions. Shooting two. That free throw, no good. Boy, this Denver team, great offensively over the last couple of seasons. How so? Well, B.A., they execute in the half courts. That's pretty simple. I mean, so difficult to do against NBA defenses. Now, normally they have multiple ball handlers on the floor, guys who can make quick decisions. No good on the second free throw. Grant, when you see players make that leap from star to superstar, think about guys like Giannis and Jason Tatum. I mean, what is that step like? You did it. Well, it's interesting. You know, you come into the league and, and, and you have success right away. But at some point, everything just clicks. It could be year four, year five, year six, usually in that window where now you figure things out and now you take that next step and become elite. Now, B.A., you know, I'm hoping that things start to click with me and my golf game. It's been about four or five years there, too. Superstar status is not in the cards for you on the golf course. Today. <laughs> now here's Schroeder. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against Portland. Vanderbilt, a screen on Smith. And here's Schroeder outside. It's hauled in by the Nuggets. And their first look at this year's Lakers squad. They won the season series last year, and on paper, it looks like they should do it again. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. And just one of the most impressive titles in league history, guys. The 2020 Lakers winning it all in the Orlando bubble. A testament to LeBron James and that team. Shooting two. That free throw, no good. You know, that 2020 bubble title for the Lakers. What made it so difficult? You know, B.A., the mental grind of all that time in the bubble. Three months in the same place. 
NBA players are used to being in four cities in a week. So it really was a different kind of challenge for them. Good on the second one. Here are the Lakers now. They're on a 12 to 1 run. Bamba, the screen on Smith. Pass to Reeves. The three is up. And Bryant pulls it down. <laughs> and I'm surprised that didn't go down. I mean, I'm sure he is too. Smith against Schroeder. Oh, nice D from Schroeder. That is not a bad decision to pull it from there. It was just a little bit off with the execution. Outside Walker. They set the pick. There's the three. Rebounded by Green. The Nuggets trail. Pass to Smith. Brown against Bama. Back to Smith. Outside for Green. Fires the three. Count it. One for one to start the game. See, he had time to line it up. And you know what? He's capable. Los Angeles shooting 33% in the first quarter. Smith against Schroeder. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. And looking at the Lakers, Richard, trying to recapture their championship level from 2020. What do you think the key is? Well, when LeBron first got there, their team was way too young. Then last year, probably too many veterans. We'll see how they can kind of find a happy balance in between the two. Free throw misses. Najee, he's checked in for Brian. He hits the second from the line. We've got 123 left in the first. Green with a screen on Schroeder. Smith with it. Now Vanderbilt defending. Vanderbilt with the block. Here's Reeves. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Walker against Brown. Walker passes to Bamba. And here is Vanderbilt. Four on the clock. Here's Reeves. And again, the Lakers, no good. Denver's gone just two for six from the arc here in the first. Smith outside to the middle. Here's Brown. Ooh, the lead pass was in the perfect spot to set up the layup. And that's how you lead a team, literally. Outside Walker. Pass to Reeves. Up top, Walker. Now Schroeder. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Shooting for Los Angeles. Dennis Schroeder at the line for two. First one at the line is good. And both free throws good for Schroeder. Well, the Nuggets shooting just 21% in the first quarter. Smith against Schroeder. Smith outside. The three is up. He got it up in time, but it would not fall for him. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers leading by six as we wrap up the quarter. And their defense has stood out, wreaking havoc for the opposition. 
More NBA on 2K Sports right after this. Just tuning in. Second quarter action is where we are. And a moment here to take a look at some hustle stats for Los Angeles. The Lakers in the lead. And so in the game for the Lakers, LeBron is the four with Davis at the five as they go small. Malik Beasley is out there with D'Angelo Russell. And it's Achimura in at the three, the small forward. Now here's Davis. He had a 21-point out again their last game against Portland. And he was also went to town on the glass and posed his will, chasing down misses all game long. Here's Jokic. Pass to Murray. Jokic against Russell. Jokic in the post. 20 points for him last game against the Trailblazers in Portland. And we'd be remiss not to mention his incredible rebounding. Just a force on the backboard. Here's Russell. Not going to go that time. Now Denver takes it the other way. Second quarter, and we're just over a minute in. And here's Jokic outside. Another missed shot. He's one of five, looking shaky out there. Beasley, pass to Russell. James against Porter. Beasley for three. Oh, he got hacked on the three-pointer, and he'll head to the line. You know, not the smartest play a defender can make there. Well, as you know, Grant, this game can be so hard on your body. As a player, how do you determine the difference between being hurt versus being injured? That's a great question, B.A. Look. Sometimes as players, you need someone to protect them from themselves. Today's game, the teams today are so smart about protecting players and preventing things from getting worse. But it really comes down to the players, the doctors, the team overall, just being smart and having a big picture about the injuries. That's good from Beasley. sinks the second and he makes all three no surprise there. He's about as automatic as it gets from the stripe. I hope I didn't jinx him. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Smith passes to Jokic. Now here's Murray. Smith outside. Jokic with a screen on Russell. Just five to shoot. And it's blocked by Davis. Smith against James. And it's James with the jam. You love his attack mentality. Never settling. Always keeping the pressure on. LeBron is second all-time on the NBA career scoring list. It's just him and Kareem at the top. As long as he stays healthy, the King will set that record. The Lakers have gone just one of three to begin the second quarter. Pass to Davis. Goes back up. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Bryant, he's checked in for the Nuggets. From Los Angeles, Anthony Davis. One shot.
That free throw good from Davis. Well, with all of LeBron's accomplishments, Richard, how would you rank breaking the scoring record? Out, For me, out. it's up there with anything LeBron James has done. This record, I don't think anyone's going to break it. Now a timeout called by Denver. And now that they have some time to get a little bit of rest, it's time for these players to regroup while hydrating themselves with some Gatorade, looking to gain a boost of energy as they continue to play in this game. And staying hydrated is the only surefire way to do it. An athlete's body doesn't have the same power and stamina without proper hydration. These guys will be sure to use this timeout wisely. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Smith passes to Bryant. Pass to Murray. Six on the shot clock. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. It's on Malik Beasley. So much NBA talent like Jamal Murray out of Canada, specifically the province of Ontario. Yeah, very true. And I think that's because guys like Murray, born in the late 90s, they grew up with the NBA in Toronto. And Jamal and others have been inspired by the Raptors. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw drops from Murray. RJ, you were in the middle of a few trades in your career, to put it lightly. What's that like as a player to get moved around so much? Thanks for bringing that up so sweetly, Brian. I appreciate <laughs> that. Look, there's pros and cons to this. It's nice to know that another organization wants you for whatever reason, but it's also tough to leave an organization that you had a connection to, the fan base. But eventually, you figure it out. And Murray drops them both. The Lakers have gotten two of five shots to fall this second quarter. Davis with a screen on Murray. Beasley with it. Now guarded by Bryant. Davis. That's good. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Now for those joining us now, we're in the second quarter. About three minutes gone by. Russell against Smith. Gordon with a screen on Russell. Shot clock at five. And he'll take a trip to the line for two. Clearly got fouled on that shot. <laughs> Man, the defender really went after him. At the line for your Nuggets, Ish Smith taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. No good on that one.
So he can't get either to fall. Here's all you need to know about how talented Anthony Davis was as a young player. He was invited to play for the U.S. national team when he was a college freshman. Now here's Porter. He's coming off a 10-point game against Portland. Smith passes to Gordon. Back to Smith. Bryant a screen on Davis. The Nuggets need to get one up. And then Bryant with the dunk. And what an aggressive move to the rim. He's really trying to fire up his teammates right now. Boy, it's not hard to feel inspired after a teammate makes that kind of finish. And that could be the spark they needed to make a little run as they try to even this thing up. AD won gold with Team USA in London in 2012. Richard, he was the only college player on the team. With all of that pressure and intensity, it probably gave AD a great taste of what life was going to be like in the NBA. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touched by James. And now it's time to take another view of that huge swat. Oh, my, oh, my. And that was textbook defense. Positioning himself well to send it back. The Nuggets making a switch here. Caldwell Pope's checked in. Shot clock at six. Gordon, the pass to Porter. Launches it. Rebounded by the Lakers. And following this one, they'll take on the Timberwolves in Minnesota. That'll be the second of two games on the road. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. Nicole Jokic again has won the league MVP, but he's not one to beat his own chest. He said, quote, I never think about it. I didn't come here to be the MVP of the league. I always think that somebody's better than me, and I want to compete to beat them. Just by that mentality alone, I'm the underdog every time. Brian? Well, it's working for him, Allie. Thanks. The Lakers have gotten four of their first nine shots to go here in the second. James with the ball. He has six. Over Gordon. Here's Davis. Second chance effort. Doesn't go for him. Excellent D there from Bryant. Denver's gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Murray against Russell. Gordon outside. On the wing, Caldwell Pope. Here's the screen by Bryant. Rebounded by the Lakers. James has got six rebounds in the game. Pass to Russell. Beasley outside. Here's James. Now here's Beasley. Davis, the pass to James. He drains it as the shot clock ticks down. James has got four points in the quarter. Powerful move by LeBron inside, not letting anything stop him from getting his shot. Murray passes to Gordon. The Nuggets with another miss. Now Los Angeles with it. They're on a 14-4 run. Hachimura finds James. From eight feet away. Out to Hachimura. Beyond the arc. Rebound by the Nuggets. Here's Caldwell Pope. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first point of the game. Pass to Bryant. Davis with a rebound. Davis has got his eighth rebound here tonight. And here's James. Back to Davis. To the inside. Porter pulls it in. Just imagine if he was shooting better. The lead would be even bigger. Here's Murray. He takes it in. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot. And will go to the line. A different look for Denver. Najee. He's checked in for Brian. Green comes in for Gordon. And it's Brown in for Michael Porter. Murray. At the line for one. 
One shot. The free throw drops from Murray. And here in the second quarter, he's starting to work himself to the free throw line. That's a good move. Walker passes to Bamba. Schroeder with it. Defended by Murray. Schroeder can't get it to go. Denver has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Outside Murray. Into the lane. And the deficit down inside single digits. Murray's got seven points here in the quarter. He was inside his own head in that first quarter. You could see it. Now he's doing a much better job of letting the game come to him. Vanderbilt, a screen on Brown. Walker with it. Now guarded by Brown. Walker against Brown. Screen by Bamba. Walker for three. The rebound by Murray. The Nuggets trail. One forty-one left to the half. Brown, a screen on Schroeder. Out to the right wing. Pass to Caldwell Pope. Green, a screen. Fires at the elbow. Caldwell Pope's shot is off. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. Bamba. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. And they've capitalized well from the free throw line. Their percentage is impressive. Mohamed Bamba taking two shots. First free throw is good. Jokic has checked in for Jamal Murray. Hits one, then misses the second attempt from the line. And Denver shooting around 29% in quarter number two. Pass to Caldwell Pope. Now Jokic. Guarded by Vanderbilt. The three. Naji. Good. <laughs> the unique passing skills of Jokic. Just fantastic at realizing when one of his guys has a clean look at the basket. Here's Reeves. Eight points in his last time out. Schroeder passes to Vanderbilt. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. All right, some time here to take a look at the 2K leaderboard. Here were the league's top shooting squads from last year. The Nuggets in second. They were so consistent with their shooting. Maybe not lights out, but they played smart and didn't let good looks go to waste. The free throw drops for Vanderbilt. Vanderbilt drops them both. And it's the Nuggets with the ball. Nine-point game. Pass to Jokic. Oh, it's blocked by Bamba. And he's able to get it back. Naji in the post. Working on Vanderbilt. Second shot opportunity. Good D by Vanderbilt. I thought he had that all sewn up, but somehow the defense just threw him off. Here's Reeves. It's rebounded by Najee. Here's Caldwell Pope. But no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Green with a screen on Schroeder. From about 16. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers with a nine-point cushion at the end of the quarter. Just pounding the painted area. That's helped him build an advantage. We'll be right back after this word.
Welcome to halftime. Glad you could join us. It's been a clash of the titans at the center spot so far. This reminds me of how the league was in my time. Amazing battles at the center position most nights. Kenny can attest to that. No, I like it like it is now, brother. Man, them threes flying up and those big men sitting on the bench. Yeah, I'm gonna sit you on your bench. And now we look back at the first half. Guys, some adjustments needed for the Denver Nuggets. You could point to their long range shooting as the main problem area. They're taking a lot of threes and their percentage is hovering in the low 30s. That's too cold, 30 degrees, you need a jacket for that. Thanks for joining us. Time to head back over to the third quarter with Brian Anderson. And we've got third quarter basketball here. Two quarters in the books. A fantastic game from Anthony Davis in this one. And in the first half, he dominated in the post. He got the looks he wanted and was able to execute. The question now is will the defense keep letting him punish them inside? Or did Coach have some new ideas for them? And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. Gordon is the four with the Joker in the middle. Murray and Caldwell Pope are the backcourt pairing. And it's Porter in at the three spot. That's the group in the game for the Nuggets. James against Gordon. Outside Russell, puts up a three. Jokic grabs the board. Jokic has got eight rebounds in the game. And Jokic throws it down. Does it get any easier than this? Just give Jokic the ball and he'll take care of the rest. Pass to James. And he drops it in from the low post. James has got 10. I know what they say, defense wins championships, but you need some bucket getters too now. Here's Murray. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. That's his first personal that one on Russell. And the intensity Murray plays with is impressive. Excellent work forcing the issue and drawing the contact. At the line for two. The first one falls. And Murray drops them both. Second half of basketball, just over a minute played so far. Pass to James. Gordon with a steal. In transition, here they come. They kick it out to Murray. Here's Caldwell Pope. Porter with it, takes the three. Rebounded by the Lakers. Davis has got nine rebounds now. And Aaron Gordon Grant, growing up in the heart of Silicon Valley, San Jose. Yeah, Aaron using that to his advantage, involved with some apps. And we've seen a lot of players getting into the tech world. Great to see guys like Gordon branching out into business. Here's Jokic. After the Lakers picking up a basket just moments ago. And he gets it back. Jokic with a screen on Beasley. Five to shoot. Caldwell Pope's shot is off. And they have been cold coming out of the break. Only getting one of their first four shots to drop this half. Got to pick it up. And here's James. 12 points for him. Pass to Davis. 16 feet out. And it's Denver with a rebound. A little under two and a half minutes gone by in the third quarter. Inside. Shot is up. And 
Gordon with the basket. On the assist by Murray. A nice touch from the big man. Gordon just burrowing himself into the paint and going to work. Pass to Davis. To the middle. Here's Russell. And out of bounds. Denver will have it. And now a chance to see what's coming up for the Denver Nuggets. On Friday, they'll be playing against Eric Bledsoe and the Utah Jazz. Then on Sunday, they'll face off against Anthony Davis and the Los Angeles Lakers. Now Gordon. Second half of play, and we're three minutes into the third here. Murray finds Porter. They kick it out to Murray. Back to Porter. The three ball. That one doesn't drop. And Los Angeles the other way now. They've led by as many as 14. No matter what he's tried, it hasn't worked. Unfortunately, the team is suffering from that. The three from Russell. That one falls. Coming off Davis' feed. Three points. Davis has got three assists in the game. Denver has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Jokic passes to Porter. Now here's Jokic. Checked by Davis. Six to shoot. Jokic against Davis. Jokic, no good. Los Angeles has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Alley. Well, guys, Commissioner Silver's open to change. He said, quote, we're not beholden to pure tradition. We care a lot about it, but all the factors I think about when we talk about changing the rules, I'm less concerned about that. We should live in the present, be respectful of those records, but also be willing to adjust when it makes sense. B.A.? All right, thanks, Alley. The Lakers have gotten three of six shots to fall so far in the third. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. A different look for Denver. Bryant, he's checked in for Michael Porter. And it's Smith in for Caldwell Pope. Reeves is checked in for Los Angeles. So it's the Lakers now. They're leading by eight. Davis with a screen on Smith. The three from Russell. And it's Denver with a rebound. Bryant's got six rebounds in the game. Smith outside. Bryant a screen on Russell. Gordon right side. From behind the arc. Connects from downtown. Now just a five-point Los Angeles lead. An area Gordon continues to work on. Now, when he's draining shots off the catch, it definitely helps with his confidence. Now here's Russell. 
He's got nine. And he's having an ugly quarter from the field. It seems really frustrating. Jokic passes to Murray. Gordon outside. Fires for three. Yes. And it's Murray picking up the assist. Murray's got his third assist of the night. And even though they're down, it's not on him. He's been lights out on offense for them. This quarter is special. Now here's Beasley. And he lobs it up to the rim. And Davis slams it home. Great game for him. Double-double now. And it's just so beautiful. The timing of that play is exceptional. Davis just gets there right on time and puts it in. You kind of wonder where his head's at. The shot selection hasn't been there. And, of course, that one was just crazy. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Had he played to stop that easy layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line. Shooting from Los Angeles. Rui Hachimura. Line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he drops the first. A different look for Denver. Najee, he's checked in for Jokic. Brown comes in for Gordon. And Green is subbed in for Smith. Both free throws good for Achimura. Denver has gone two of six from downtown here in the second half. Ryan a screen on Achimura. To the inside. And down it goes. Dumped it through off a beautiful setup. And one move ahead of the defense. A solid pick. And then the monster dunk to complete the play. Well done. Well, great chemistry on display. He understood where to put the screen in order to free up his teammate. Now here's Schroeder. Down to five on the shot clock. Pass to Achimura. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. Reeves. And again, no good by the Lakers. Outside, Green. And here's Bryant, covered by Bamba. Murray against Schroeder. Bryant a screen on Schroeder. Murray for three. Hachimura with a rebound. Hachimura's got five rebounds tonight. Here's Reeves. Outside Vanderbilt. Pass to Reeves. The bucket is good. And the Lakers lead by six. The Nuggets have gone six of 13 to open up this second half. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. And here's Bryant outside. And it's out of bounds to the Nuggets as Denver retains possession. Walker, he's checked in for Achimura. And it's the Nuggets with the ball. Brown inside. Walker covering. The Nuggets with another miss. The Lakers have gone 5 of 11 in this third quarter. Vanderbilt a screen on Murray. Here's Walker. Pass to Reeves. Six on the shot clock. 4-3. And it's Denver with a rebound. Bryant's got rebound number eight now. And let's be honest, they're winning in spite of his atrocious shooting performance. Back to Murray. This one for three. Vanderbilt pulls it in. Okay, now I think he's starting to get in his own head right now. Maybe he's overthinking things a little bit, and as a result, he's just been off. Walker against Brown. Nice shot by Walker. Walker's got this first bucket of the night. 
pulling no punches, attacking the heart of that defense. Now a timeout called by Denver. Timeout. Timeout. Failing to find a rhythm Good. offensively, something that needs to change and change soon. And coach called his timeout to try and reset things on offense, shake them up a bit so they can hopefully start getting some shots to fall. One twenty-one left in the third. Pass to Brown. Back to Murray. And again, Denver no good. The Lakers in the lead. Now here's Walker. Fifty-four seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Everyone in the building saw the obvious contact. Taking two shots. Shooting two. First free throw is good. Caldwell Pope's checked in for the Nuggets. He does not get the second one. The Nuggets trail. Pass to Murray. 40 seconds left to play in the third quarter of basketball. Another miss. Boy, they're in a funk right now. Uh, you know, some people could say he's struggling on offense this period. I like to think of more of drowning. Just can't seem to find his confidence. Now here's Schroeder. Shot clock at six. Ten feet away. A clear look for Bamba. That one falls. Coming off Schroeder's feed. And the Lakers lead by 11. Nice ball movement there. Delivered the pass right on time. Now Murray shoots over Schroeder. Here's Caldwell Pope. Offline with a three. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers. Closing out the quarter ahead by 11 points. Appearing in control, but could still use a little more of a push to feel totally comfortable in this one. We'll be right back. And let's listen to head coach Michael Malone review the game plan with his guys. Stay positive. Don't get down. 
We got a lot of time left. We're going to win the game. We are going to win the game. Michael Malone trying to get each guy to believe in himself, believe that this can still happen. And the players have to trust each other as well. It's going to take all five guys working together to recapture the momentum. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. And the Lakers, looking at who they've got. LeBron is the four, with Davis at the five as they go small. D'Angelo Russell is out there with Dennis Schroeder. And it's Reeves in at the small forward. And he gets that one. Yeah, just too much big boy basketball by LeBron James. Just bodying defenders inside. Murray passes to Jokic. Another shot. And it's blocked. What a play as he just snatches the shot out of midair. Davis against Jokic. Davis, the pass to Russell. Schroeder with it from 11 feet away. The rebound by Murray. It hasn't been his best game, but his team is still doing just enough to be up. Over to the wing. Davis against Jokic, and it's good. Two points. This is why Jokic is an all-star caliber talent. He has an ability to hit hard, contested shots. To the paint. And then Russell with the dunk. And he just driving the stake in him there. He's a guy who just never lets up. And that finish shows you how dangerous he can be as a passer and a finisher. Now here's Murray. Jokic with it. Back to Murray. Jokic the screen from deep three-point range. And they get it back. On the wing, Caldwell Pope from deep. They get it again. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touch by Gordon. And the Lakers making a change here. Beasley's checked in. And we're about two minutes into the fourth now. James against Gordon. Davis with a screen on Gordon. Here's James. And Davis slams it home. Great find by Braun using his basketball IQ. If you don't understand how smart he is, just ask him. Murray from outside sends it home from three-point land. Didn't get a three in the first half, but now he's on the board with his first triple of the game. Pass to James. Fade away. That shot's good. Russell making the play. Russell's got three assists in the game. Some slippage at the defensive end here in the second half, allowing the offense to establish more of a rhythm. Murray passes to Jokic. Now here's Porter. Outside Murray. Here's Jokic. Second chance shot. And that's two points on the layup. You gotta box out the big man, Jokic. When you don't, he makes you pay. Here's James. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. It goes on Aaron Gordon. When you look at the career that LeBron has put together, one of the all-time greats, amazingly lived up to the hype he had coming out of high school. And the immense pressure LeBron has had since day one of the NBA. Many others would have folded, Grant. You're very Shoot true, B.A. The expectations he had were just insane. Anything less than a top five player all time would be a disappointment. That's not fair to ask of any player coming into the league, much less a high schooler. And he knocks down the first one. What I appreciate about LeBron is how much he loves being a leader. He knows how much his teammates count on him. Hachimura has checked in for the Lakers. That one misses, so he goes one for two. For Denver, they've gotten four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. Up top, Porter. Hachimura covering. Jokic with a screen on Russell. Murray passes to Jokic. Clock at six. And here is Porter. For three. That falls. Nice feed from Jokic. 
Jokic has got three assists tonight. His first triple of the second half. Can he get it going? Pass to James. Fades and shoots. And it goes. That makes him 9 for 13 now. And his ability to efficiently score, that's really helped him out in this one. Putting them ahead on the scoreboard. Jokic with a screen on Russell. Murray, no good. Defense pulled out all the stops to shut him down there. And here's Hachimura. Pass to Davis. Over Murray. And Davis with the basket on the assist by Beasley. And now it's a 12-point Laker lead. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. He's just riding the wave of momentum right now, getting to his spots and keeping things simple on the offensive side. The Lakers have gotten almost all of their shots to fall in the fourth. Six of seven. Down low. It's deflected. Long arms and just great instincts. That's how Gordon finds the big block opportunity. Shooting from Los Angeles. D'Angelo Russell taking two shots. Shooting two. Free throw is good from Russell. He is so talented. There's very little Russell can't do. It's just about the consistency, but the talent is all there. And he can't hit the second. The Nuggets have gotten five of 12 shot attempts to go so far in the fourth quarter. Back to Porter. Jokic passes to Murray. And it's Murray finishing it off. Oh, explosive move. Sometimes Murray doesn't get enough credit for his athleticism. Pass to James. Back to Russell. It's James on the wing. Defended by Gordon. James inside. Gordon's on him. And there's a three-second violation. Denver's gone two of four from the perimeter here in the fourth quarter. Outside Murray. Pass to Jokic. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's a big man down there. I mean, when Jokic gets ideal positioning inside, he uses his size to draw contact. Two shots. And he makes a first. Drafted 41st overall in the 2014 NBA Draft, Jokic has turned a lot of heads. The versatility he has is unreal. And Jokic drops them both. And they've done well from the free throw line this half. No misses yet. The Lakers in the lead. James, outside. Gordon pulls it in. Gordon's got his fourth rebound in this one. Order the pass to Gordon. Murray against Russell. Gordon with a screen on Russell. Pass to Gordon. The three. James with the rebound. The Lakers have gone six for nine here in the fourth quarter. Hachimura from long range. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. James has got four assists in the game. And Denver's shooting a low 30% from the floor. Murray against Russell. Murray passes to Gordon. 
And again, Denver no good. For Los Angeles, they've gotten seven of their first ten shots to go during this fourth quarter. He's been tremendous at corralling misses all night long. It's because he's reading where the shots are going and getting to the right position. Just outworking everyone early on the glass. Now here's Porter. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. This is not the same guy we saw in the first half. Credit him for finding a way to shake off those first two quarters. Now a timeout called by Denver. That's his second personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for Denver, Nikola Jokic. Shooting one. Nuggets call timeout. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Guys, thanks a lot. I had a chance to hear what Mike Malone was saying to his team. It wasn't feel-good pep talk. He wants them to show some fight in the closing moments. He told them, if you guys want to salvage any respect from this game, now's the time to do it. Show them we are better than this. Guys, take it away. Okay, thank you, Allie. Los Angeles has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. And he's going for the lob and finished off by Davis. And this is exactly how Russell does solid assist numbers. I mean, just great delivery on that play. Now here's Murray. Pass to Jokic. There's the call on Rui Achimura. That's his first foul of the game. Reeves has checked in for the Lakers. Lakers substitution. Reeves. Murray against Russell. And out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. The Lakers have gone 8 of 12 so far here in the fourth. Pass to James. To the inside, Davis. Great D that time from Jokic. Denver has gone 2 of 6 so far in the fourth. With the step back, here's Gordon. James with the block. Oh, look at the old man still getting it done on defense. LeBron James still takes great pride in rejecting shots. Now, here is James. Here's Davis. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. It's on Nikola Jokic. <laughs> so close on the finish. I mean, it could have been a three-point opportunity. Anthony Davis at the line for two. Shoot two. First one falls for him. And Anthony Davis on the NBA's top 75 list. Grant, you think that was a controversial selection? Well, 
I mean, it was mostly due to how young Davis still is. You can't argue with the all-NBA selection and numbers. And, of course, being a recent champion may have put him over the top. Both free throws good from Davis. Davis definitely wants to be better from here. He knows that he can improve on his percentage from the line. Murray against Russell. The drive by Murray. And it's Murray finishing it off. <laughs> I tell you, a little extra pressure on D when you're up against a point guard who can elevate. Ha, it doesn't make it easy, does it? Yeah, hard to strategize for a guy who can make a pass or a play like this right in your face. And we know he can pass the ball. But wow, what a great finisher as well. Jokic delivering when his team needs him. And there's the screen. Here's James. Out to the right wing. Just five on the clock to the paint. Shot is good by Reeves. And this is a game they can build off of. They kept their focus all game long, and it will get marked as a win for the Lakers. Hey, if you get yourself to the line and cash in on those opportunities, you paint your opponent into a corner. Yeah, they were so successful with that all night. Aggressive, fearless, whatever you want to call it, they really pushed the action and got rewarded. And this one concludes with their second victory of the year. It's just the start of this season series with three games left between them, but it must feel great to take the first meeting. We've come to expect big-time games from him. Just another day at the office for Anthony Davis. I think his authoritative defense was huge for them tonight. He established early that he wasn't allowing easy buckets. It's hauled in by the Nuggets. I hate to say it, but I'm pretty sure we can close the book on this one. Yeah, they fought as hard as they could. Just wasn't in the cards tonight. Here's Murray. That falls. Nice feed from Jokic. An elite passer at his position. Jokic just seems to have eyes in the back of his head sometimes. Now James. And so it's the Lakers with the W. They have to feel good about this performance. It's one they can be proud of. Very true. I mean, when you're out on the road, the wins can feel a little sweeter. This one has to feel extra special. Well, now we have some time to check in with Allie LaForce. Allie. LeBron, that was an impressive win. What did it take to get it done tonight? It's a really good team that we're playing. They're very resilient, just like us. They play together, they play hard, they play tough. So we had to bring that fight tonight. You brought it, it paid off. Congrats. Thanks, Allie. Great interview once again. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. This is Brian Anderson saying thanks for tuning in as New Balance presents our player of the game, Anthony Davis.